<laughs> Looking for work is a tough job uh, for anybody, especially now when the job market is just, you know, terrible. A lot of people think maybe the Internet is the solution. Well, that's the conventional wisdom, but maybe not the right answer. Richard Bowles should know, and we're going to ask him. He is the expert. This book, What Color Is Your Parachute, came out in 1970. Seven million copies later, I have mine from 1970 when I was in high school, and it's still the book for My finding a job. It's revised every year. Oh, yeah, by the way, it has changed. <laughs> Richard, it's, it's an honor to meet you. Thank I wouldn't be doing what I'm doing if I hadn't read this book when I was a kid, Look, you know, deciding what I wanted to do for a living. Great. And you still cover that, right? Mm -hmm. how, to, how to figure out what you want. Exactly. That's what, col that's what it means, I guess, what yeah. color is your parent. What does that mean? <laughs> I'm sure you're asked this in every interview, but I've got to ask you. Everybody, when the book first came out in 1970, everyone was talking about these guys that have to bail out. And somebody would say, I've decided to bail out. And I right. thought, that's either a leaky rowboat <laughs> or, or they're jumping, or out of the, jumping out of an airplane. Of so I, I tweeted and asked them, what color is your parachute? As you're jumping, <laughs> yes. pick the right color. 12 languages, 20,000 people a month buy this book. I mean, it still yeah. is the success. But things have changed a lot since 1970. Lot. Here we are 33 years later, and the Internet is here. Yeah. A positive or a negative, you think, in job searching? It's so hard to say because there's five uses that job hunters can make of the Internet. Well, let's talk about those. Yeah. What are the five? Uh, the two worst ones are job postings and resume postings. Don't do that? Well, I'll tell you why. They're dangerous. Um, the third is research about mm -hmm. yourself or t taking tests. Yeah. Semi-counseling on some sites. Okay. Uh, the next one is c uh, contacts. Okay. You are, Networking kind of. Yeah, yeah. where you know, I, I want to find a job in Bellingham, Washington. Right. Before the internet, I couldn't really do that very easily. I oh, might I see. Yeah. Contact people it's in my global. own church. Yeah. Right, but right. now, chat rooms, forums, uh, like on Craigslist and right, stuff, right, to help. Right. And what is the fifth number one? five? Uh, it's only been 33 years. I <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, let's. I'm, plus, I'm 76. <laughs> so you did. So you were my age when you did this book. Uh -huh. Were you always, is that always your, what you did? Uh, no, no, I, I'm an ordained Episcopal priest. No kidding. Yeah. But people came to you and said, help me? I... I was supervising every campus minister in the nine western states, and they all were being thrown out of a job because in the 1970s, downsizings were going on in the churches nationwide in all denominations. Nothing's changed. <laughs> no, it sure has People are still looking for work. All right, well, let's go through the, the, the four, and maybe the fifth will come to you. So you say, number one, uh, Job postings and resume postings on the internet. What's what's wrong with that? Why shouldn't I be using that to get a? Uh, oh, I if I was job hunting, I would use every aid the internet has, but I would make uh, several rules for myself before I tried it. Okay. These are sort of a context in which to look at how useful the internet is. Yeah. The first is to make a huge distinction between usage and success. Every year, more and more people use the websites like Monster and so on. It keeps going up every single year. But the issue is how many actually find a job. And Forrester Research, two years ago, did a research to find out. They found if you went to the employer's site or to one of these uh, large boards like Monster, uh, there was a 4% chance you'd find a job. 4%? Yes. 1 in 25. What, why so bad? Uh, a number of reasons. Uh, let's take these job agents that so many boards have now where you... Right. 62% of those who are online job hunters. Right. Um, you, you enter in some what you're looking for. Yeah, it calls yeah, through yeah. all the jobs and it sends you an email every I day. I call it uh, searching by night. Yeah. While you're asleep. Oh, yeah. Searching while you're asleep. Right, right. Um, uh, two thirds of those people never even get a contact. This just doesn't work. It doesn't work. And is it that there's so many resumes now online that you're yeah. kind of you're buried? This I, I I had to write out some things here. Uh, one guy called me, and he runs a job site, which I don't want to mention, and he counted 40 million resumes on the Internet. And probably half of those people aren't even looking for work anymore. That's right. It's uh, just it's noise. I always say, when you put your resume on the Internet, it's going to become immortal. <laughs> they sell, That's right. They, they never erase they, one. Yeah, they, they'll, they'll sell so, the information from one company to another. So, so. use it 
Okay, but don't count on it. It's that's not right. going to be your. It's not really going to be your best bet. What should people do that's going to really give you? Well, benefit? that's the next thing that you have to do. The research. There's all kinds of research. Pew puts out research on internet use and so on. Mm -hmm. And what you find out, I, I looked up two statistics on the internet. The internet for research is just fantastic. Oh, isn't it great? What a, yeah. what a revolution. All right. So the first thing is, how do companies hire? Turns out. 40% do the hiring from employer, employee referrals. That's who you know, isn't yeah, it? So it always know, has if been. You, if you can pick a company you really like to work for in the industry that fascinates you, and you know somebody inside that company, uh, as I said, that's your greatest luck. The, the but that's what you were saying. Method. Contacts. Yeah. Getting to know people. Mm -hmm. The more people you know, the better your chance of getting a job. Right. Because they're going to say, oh, I know this guy. He's good. With one exception. You have to have done the homework on yourself to know what your best skills are that you most love using. Another thing you can do online, there's tests. Princeton there Review are. has tests. Yes. There's, I mean, I use this. Yeah. You have some great <laughs> quizzes and stuff to really think about yeah. what it is you want, what you're looking yeah. for. We hope. <laughs> Richard, I wouldn't be here doing what I'm doing if I hadn't read this book, and everybody should read it. And if, believe you me, when my kid's getting ready to graduate from high school, they're going to get a copy. Absolutely. <laughs> And you just keep making them, okay? Yeah. What Color Is Your Parachute is the name of the book. Ten Speed Press, the publisher. They're at tenspeed.com. Or you can go to our website, techtv.com slash call for help. And, and I have a website. You have a website? Yeah. Oh, why, you do? What's it called? Jobhuntersbible.com. Another great resource. You've got t stuff on there, tests, mm -hmm. information, mm -hmm. how to get a job. Uh, and I have to say, I agree with you. I know many people out of work, been out of work for a year, who've used those online sites and have not, like, you know, yeah. Monster I have not been able to find it. I well, the percentage it. of success has gone up 10% now instead of 4. So 10 out of every online still job owners find a job. The old ways go. still work. Yeah. Use it, but there are, old, there are other ways that, right. to enhance Networking your success. Networking is the most successful it is, isn't it? People hire people they know or friends yeah. of friends. I ask everybody. I eat at a restaurant. I say to the waitress, how did you get a job here? Oh, I knew so-and-so yeah. over there. That's that, absolutely. Yeah, that's bottom how line. it happens. What a pleasure to meet you. Thank you, you know, so much for being on the show. Welcome. Please come back. Thanks. Ten Speed Press, what color is your parachute? Richard Bowles, B-O-L-L-E-S. And his, jo his website is, once again, jobhuntersbible.com. Jobhuntersbible.com, because that's what this is.